How will climate change affect our world in 100 years? Climate change is real, and it's changing our lives and the world around us. It would only take an increase of 3 degrees Celsius to completely change our fate. The United Nations warns that our very survival would be at risk if we fail to limit carbon emissions and rising temperatures. The world population is projected to reach 11.2 billion in the year 2100, and human society would struggle to get by in a warming world. For instance, heat waves will be 39 times more common than they were in the 19th century, the Arctic will run out of ice at the end of each summer, and northern Europe will experience frequent flooding. Coral reefs would completely disappear under such temperatures. In Mediterranean countries, there would be such a lack of rain that they would become desert areas, leading to waves of mass migration. According to a recent report, climate change could force more than 200 million people to leave their homes by 2050 unless urgent action is taken. As Earth's average surface temperature continues to increase over the next several decades, ice will melt and sea levels will rise. Current scenarios project a temperature increase of around 5 degrees Celsius above pre-industrial levels by 2100. This increase will be caused mainly by coal use and a massive release of methane from Arctic permafrost. Some simulations show that global average temperatures will keep on increasing beyond the year 2100. In this scenario, the best crop growing areas will move towards the poles. Places with long histories of cultural and ecosystem richness like the Amazon basin may become barren. These developments will create new challenges. Some people will flee the flooding coasts while others will experience extended severe drought. Crop failure will become more frequent and less of the planet will be as habitable as it was in the past. The climate change driven ecological destruction that we are witnessing today is the result of a mere 0.8 degrees Celsius rise in average temperature since the year 1800. We can only imagine what a further 1.2 degrees Celsius rise before 2100 will mean. The CO2 that we are emitting from fossil fuels today will still be affecting the climate many millennia from now. The majority of CO2 emitted from burning coal or oil will be absorbed over a few centuries by the oceans and vegetation, but around 25% of it will still be lingering in the atmosphere for over 1,000 years from now. Scientists are trying to answer questions related to problems we are going to face in the future. How many people can the planet support? Can we grow and deliver enough food for all the communities? And most importantly, are we going to make the right decisions and leave no one behind? What we know for a fact is that it is more important than ever to achieve carbon neutrality and to prevent global warming from exceeding 1.5 degrees Celsius. Each degree Celsius counts, and if we fail to meet the Paris Agreement goals, the consequences could be devastating. More than 99% of peer-reviewed scientific papers agree that climate change is mainly caused by humans. This general consensus is proven by a survey of more than 88,000 climate-related studies. We have to change, and actions speak louder than words. Climate action is the answer. Do you think that humanity will be able to deal with climate change? Share your thoughts in the comment section.